Hi guys, my name is Simi and I'm a soon-to-be physician associate and today I'm going to be giving you guys five tips on how to survive the physician associate course. First tip is to find your tribe. Find the people that you gel best with, find the people that you can study with, that you can vent with, that you can play with, um, find the people that are very like-minded to yourselves. Um, it just makes a already stressful course a bit more easier. Um, I definitely had my tribe and my people that I would go to that would help me survive the course. I don't know how I would have survived and how I would have kept sane um, without these people. So yeah, my first tip is definitely find your tribe. My second tip on surviving the course is to study little and often. So we all know with the physician associate course, you are studying the breadth of medicine in two years. Um, there's so much to cover. The best thing I can advise is for you to study little and often. Every day, maybe for like two to three hours, pick an area of medicine that you want to focus on. Study a little bit and often means that by the time it gets to exams, you don't feel like you are cramming, you don't feel stressful and you don't, you don't feel stressed and you don't feel like everything is going to completely overwhelm you. Especially when you are on your hospital rotations, it's much harder to study. But when you study little and often, you find that you cover more. And when it comes to exam season, you're not learning anything new for the first time. You're simply just literally revising all the things that you already know. My third tip for surviving the course is when you start placement, be proactive. The thing with students is that sometimes they can be known for getting in the way. You're then new, you don't know anyone, you don't know how things um, are ran. Um, the best thing you can do for yourself is to be proactive. Put yourself out there, say that, hey, I'm the physician associate on this ward, I'm new here, what can I help? What can I um, get stuck into? Um, how can I assist you guys? Even if that is clerking notes, that's examining the patient, that's getting things together before the ward round, be proactive. The more proactive you are, the more you are seeing that you're, um, that you're super um, keen, you're super eager to learn, and that way you'll be exposed to more opportunities Doctors, especially senior consultants and regs, they love to see students that are super enthusiastic and that way they're more inclined to kind of bring you in and um, expose you to the weird and wonderful things that you see in medicine. My fourth tip is that don't let imposter syndrome kick in. It's so easy to kind of feel like you don't belong here, especially when you're not understanding a particular topic or you're on placement and you've had a bad day. It's so easy to feel like, why am I here? I can't do this. But you can't let those voices um, throw you off your game. The, what I always tell people is that you are more than qualified to be here. The fact that you're even on the course, the fact that you've managed to jump through all these hoops to actually get to this position means that you deserve to be here and you are qualified to be here. Never let those voices kind of get you down and make you feel like you're not good enough. Always remember that you've earned your place here and you are more than capable to become the best physician associate you can ever be. And my fifth and final tip, which I think is the most important tip of this course, is enjoy yourself. Two years flies by so quick. Take lots of pictures, make lots of memories, make lots of friends. I'm super grateful for the university I studied at, the friends I've made, the memories we've had. Um, I, can't, I can't imagine going anywhere else. Um, by the time you blink, it's your first, it's your first day, you blink and then you're sitting nationals. Time goes by so quickly. So just have fun, enjoy yourself. Study hard, but definitely, definitely play harder. Um, just have fun. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity. It's a very, very, very crazy roller coaster of a ride. But um, yeah, you will have so much fun um, if you just enjoy the ride and just, you know, go with the flow.